Okay, we're back. Let's get this finished for now. So I was looking and I was thinking, well, we'll be able to add stuff throughout the course of time. And the more I look at it, the more I'm thinking, even though he's heavy, where did I put him? In there. In the drawer. Oops. Ugh. What did I put him in there? I put him in there. I'm thinking of adding the balloon dog. He's quite hefty. It would be cool on there. Let's leave him stood over there for the moment while we think about that. Because I was thinking it's gone over time, I'm going to add to this and add to this. So it's more charm than bracelet. For now, I'm thinking of going Big Bone with Paul. Little Bone won't hang right, but I think Big Bone will. So I'm going to put. Bone on bone on paw, paw on bone, on a big one. Let's see how it looks. Definitely makes a difference when I'm doing these links. Okay. I think that can work. So boom. Pull. I think I'll add them and I'll add these and then we'll see where we go from there. That's the plan. So back to the super dinky pingy pingy little links. So you. Oh yes, I did not think about that, did I? Floor we go again. Okay, you're next. Can we see? Mm. Okay, I'll be back again in a moment. Again, thankfully it was easy to find. Right, so we're on you. Let's try not to ping. Right. You onto there. You onto there. You no pinging, if you please. Onto there. Okay. Roll on this side. On that one right there. Let's put a big one on. It's not pink again. I know you're thinking about it, aren't you? You. 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 Okay. Nope. Oh, you've done your 
twizzle, haven't you? Right. You next. So let's try that again. happening there. Right. Do we go? Little doggy. And then double bone again. So do you like double bones? some more little ones either way. I don't think we're popping any more of these on there. I'll save them. Let's pop those in here. For now. So we can pop these. Let's put all these straight in this nice little bag. 
I'll do that in a moment. I'm going to be filling around with things. Right, I'm going to put these away because we're not going to use those ones anymore. Are we going to use the paw for anything? Don't know yet. Don't know yet. Definitely the bones because we've got finishing work to do. And potentially the big guy. So let's put that over there. So do we go for just a little sitting doggy by itself and then bones? Let's link sitting doggy. other little sitting doggy. This could be the tiniest bit straighter. Save you for another day. I'm going to doggy doggy. Double bones. You. Call it that. Yep, we will save Paul for another day because we are going to be adding more at some point. This is going to be as far as it goes today. And we are going to stick you on there. Even though you're heavy, the rest is going to be heavy by the time I'm done. And this is going to be a long term, well, not, yeah, quite a long term project. I'm going to be looking for more throughout my time to add to this. So I can make it, let's say, more charm than bracelet. So, yeah, that's what we're going to do. So, we'll do another pair of bones. And you, another pair of bones, and you, you, because they're going to go first, then the bones, then you. And then, stop there, I think. Yes. So I'm going to put the rest of these in here for now save them for next time and when we have added these last few you can go in the random selection I forget I think it's called a rope chain that's the ones you can use those for put the rest of these bones in there So what do we need? We need one more, one more, and probably not one more because we've got a big one on here. So we can do because that big one will be too big for the little one. We'll see. So we'll keep you out for a second. Put all these ones back. So then we need one more, two more, three more. And you. Though that one's quite a big solid one, it might just go on as it is. We'll see. So we'll keep that out for a second, but we will put these little ones back so we don't need those. Right. But we'll leave them there for the moment because we might also put some back. We'll see. So this little guy first. This little gal. So this one. 
I think I'm still good for space, so I can't bear that in mind to be using the phone. Let's pop you on there. considering pinging aren't you? You are. You there. You there. You there. You there. I'll see that coming. Repurchase. You there? Now we're going to have that one right there. Let's get you and you on. Send wherever it's gone. There it is. We want that one. That one right there. Now I just put this one straight on. It's got a nice big one here to work with. 
it's quite solid. So we just go with that and make him, him an exception to the rule of using the little one. Because he'll hang fine. Right, let's make sure he's open enough. Put you on there like that. Close you up. The tiniest of pinches if I can get you that way. Back here, you you ain't getting away with it that easily. I think I'm going to be able to get this on myself. I think I'm going to have to employ my other half to do this. Let's see. Clasp. I was able to get it on by myself when it didn't have a bajillion charms attached to it. I don't think I'm going to be able to now. I think I'm definitely going to have to employ my wrath. can't bend my hand in the way that I need to to get the ends to meet. And even if I get it on I don't know if I'll be able to get it off again. I've done that, I could probably slip that on and off my wrist, I've got quite small hands. We did it! We did it! With my little girl's teeth. Oh, there we go. We are done, and all it took was perhaps an hour and a half. So let's put away what we're done with for now. I'm going to constantly keep my eye out for bits that we can add to this. So we can eventually add more and more and more to make it the ultimate doggy charm bracelet. I'll put these 
all in here now. You can go loose now, guys. You can be free. Join the puppy party. Oh, it makes such a cool sound. I don't tend to wear bracelets, but I will wear this one with pride. Pop you also in there. I'll put all the jump rings in with the necklace bits. Excess bag of doggy charms to be added to. Jump rings and pieces. You can go in there. I'll have to get a nice little containers start building up jewelry bits in so I have got other random jewelry bits but it is like um, more beads and whatnot as opposed to anything like this but there you go it's done it's done I'm so so pleased with it I'll have to show my graph later see what he thinks but as you can see somewhere around here there's a nice bit of space to add some more bits. I thought he'd be too heavy, but given the weight of everything on that, he's not. I could probably slide that off, but what I'll do instead is I'll take it off nicely. Because it's always easier to undo, she says. Maybe this is on until my other half gets home. Let's see if we can do what we did before. I will be able to get this in my mouth. I held it in my mouth while I undid the clasp. Can I do that again? I don't think I can. I think this is all until my other half gets home. Nope, there we go. Free! So there we go, that was actually more relaxing, it didn't seem like it at parts because it wasn't when I kept pinging bits everywhere, but it was, as I said, during the pingy moments, it was definitely worth it, I do love that, it is so so cool, and I can't wait to add more to it. So it becomes larger than life, it will become bigger than it's able to hold itself. But yeah, that is so cool. I do love the sound. So jangly. And all ones that make me think of my little girls. So yeah. Thank you all so much for stopping by and riding this one out with me. I hope you've enjoyed it. I hope it's given you an idea to create one yourself based on something you really love. Um, like I say, my girls, they are my world. Them and my other half. But I'm not going to make a charm bracelet of my other half. I will of my babies. So yeah. I hope that's inspired you. I hope you've enjoyed it. It was fun. There were some trying moments, but when you're trying something fiddly like this, there is going to be trying moments. So, and I'm also trying to get used to where the centre is of, uh, of the phone when I'm recording, so I do end up slipping over this way every now and again. Um, so yeah, thank you all so much. Uh, like if you like what you see, comment if you've got something to say, subscribe if you really like what you see and you want to see more, and know when it's coming. And yeah, take care. And see you in the next one.